You know what I'm saying? At some point, man, you have to grow up, man. You have to let bygones be bygones. Like, especially if you ain't gonna kill NBA young boy. This man right here ain't got nothing to do with that. YouTube gang was happening, man. Welcome back to the channel, man. Back to another video, man. I hope y'all doing all right, bro. You feel what I'm saying? We got some good content for y'all tonight, man. But before we hop in all that, I need y'all to know all the new folk. They call me done. You feel me? Go ahead and do me a solid. Go ahead and like the video. Subscribe to the channel. If you subscribe, make sure you ring that bell. Ring that bell. Make sure you hit all, oh, man. Join the gang. Join the mob. You feel me? Now, gang, we got some good content for y'all tonight. Like I said, and we got that boy. Vaughn. I pay the rent. Yeah, and I got a kid. Damn. Plus, his pocket's thick. Now, we got King Vaughn tonight, man. Honestly, we got uh, his sister, Kayla B. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I don't know, man. She back, she back on everybody's radar back in the media and it's like it's just crazy we're gonna hop right into it though but before we do i need y'all know i got another channel couple channel with my lady man it's called life with the duns link in the description below y'all make sure y'all tap in over there man you feel what i'm saying we finna get ready to go to mexico so y'all make sure y'all tap in man especially if you like to travel because we gonna take y'all with us man hope y'all locked and loaded packed up ready to go you ain't gotta spend no money all you gotta do is like videos and subscribe like no cap you gonna be right in mexico i promise you that game like, no cap. Just make sure you go over there and subscribe. And I got another channel, man. It's called King Dunn Reacts 2. Honestly, I don't know where I'm going with the channel, man. I got a lot of different ideas, but, you know what I'm saying? I do react to, like, real-life events over there. So, if you're into that, make sure you go over there. Rock out over there. But, uh, we're going to get into this content, though. All right, gang. So, as y'all see, it says, King Von's sister, Kayla B., called Man a Weirdo for wearing an NBA Youngboy shirt. It say... Laugh my A off. Who know this man? Who walks around with another grown man on their shirt? Laugh my A off. Laughing emojis. Bye. Get from in front of here. I don't know. That's crazy. I mean, I got a couple. I got a Tupac shirt. I got a Scarface shirt. Like, I don't understand. Like, maybe he's just an NBA young boy fan. Like, let's just, let's look at it first, bro. Let's look at it. Sir, he with the ops. Ops, sir. But look at him. Opster, he looks like an opster. Opster, weirdo. Where's Charlie? Charlie is weirdo. Who walks around with an other man on his shirt? He's a weirdo. He got another grown man on his shirt. That's crazy, bro. I think at some point, bro, you have to grow up. You know what I'm saying? At some point, man, you have to grow up, man. You have to let bygones be bygones. Like, especially if you ain't gonna kill NBA young boy. This man right here ain't got nothing to do with that. You know what I'm saying? This man, this man probably just like NBA Youngboy. NBA has a large fan base. He has a fan base that ranges from three years old to probably 40. You feel what I'm saying? Like, everybody is not going to hate NBA Youngboy because he supposedly mocked your brother's death. You dig? Like, come on, man. You got, you just got to come. Some stuff you just don't post to like just, okay. He got on the NBA Youngboy shirt. You may see somebody down the road with a Vaughn shirt. So the one with a Vaughn shirt, what is, what is he? You said, what kind of man, grown man with another man on his shirt? What if it was Vaughn? Like, you, you would have probably took a picture with him. Hey, how you doing? All kind of stuff. But since it's young boy, you got an issue with it. Now, the thing about it is, you don't even know this man, probably. What if when you start calling this man all kind of names and stuff, he would have just, Wah! he would have, you know what I mean? Or he would have pulled out a blick in you. Or what if that was one of NBA young boy's brothers or something, and it really would have been an issue. You did what I'm saying? Like, like I said, it's time for people to grow up. Okay, Vaughn is gone. A lot of people were hurt by that. You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to sit up here and lie and say I was hurt. Like, I couldn't get up and go to work the next day or nothing like that. But I was like, dang, Vaughn is gone. Like, I listened to his music for a long time after he died, bro. Like, for real. Because it was kind of unreal that Vaughn was gone. I guess I, I guess I got to put myself in her position. I don't know. Maybe it's just like, okay. But NBA didn't, didn't even kill Vaughn. Like, I don't, I don't get it, bro. I don't get it. Maybe y'all get it, man. So y'all drop y'all opinions on it in the comment section down below. But me personally, I think when it comes to that situation, man, whatever happened doesn't happen, man. You know what I mean? People don't lost their life and all that. So I think they should just let that go. Especially when you talking about fans. You feel me? Now, if she would have saw a young boy and decided that she wanted to basically get some get back or do something to young boy, I totally understand that. A Quando or any of them boys. But to... But to see a fan and be like, you you weird because you wearing a young boy shirt. Like, come on. That's crazy. That's crazy. I ain't going to cap, but a, a long time ago, they say somebody rolled through making, playing Gucci Mane, and they, and they shot his car. Like, 
maybe people just get like that. I don't know. You feel me? If you know the whole making Gucci Mane story, then comment down below what I'm talking about. You feel what I'm saying? But anyway, in the meantime, between the time I go by done, I don't forget to comment like subscribe to that channel. Don't forget to ring that bell, ring that bell. Make sure you hit all 2300 by tomorrow. 3K we on the way. 10K by the end of the month, man. And y'all know we going out to that 100K plaque. I'm going to say it on every video until we get it and hang it up right up here somewhere. Like, no cap. I know it's coming, man. You feel me? Anything possible with a little faith and a lot of work. Remember that. See y'all in a minute. See you on the next one. Let's get it.